All right, today we're gonna to talk about the carnivore diet and what you can eat. Diet's pretty simple. It's meat, it's fish, it's eggs, and it's dairy. What can you drink? Water, coffee, and tea. You're basically trying your best to stay away from any type of carb. There's carbs hidden in everything. They're not the end of the world. But you wanna eat nutrient-dense food. What is nutrient-dense food? It's animal products. So, uh, if you wanna eat stuff like sour cream, tzatziki, not a problem. If you wanna eat stuff like mayonnaise as a condiment, not a problem. Cheese is dairy, but you don't wanna be eating a ton of cheese. It's more of a, more of a condiment type thing. Like if you want cheese on your burger, put some brie on your steak, that's no problem, knock yourself out. But don't sit there and eat the whole tub or the whole brick in one sitting. That's not gonna help you. Uh, milk, milk is dairy. But milk has a lot of sugar in it. So try and stick to more of a cream, heavy cream. Put that in your coffee, put that in your tea. It's not a problem. What else? Fruits and vegetables, well, there's not really any vegetables in this diet. If you want to eat hot sauce, sure, go ahead. There's no carbs in that. If something has no carbs in it, you can pretty much eat it, but I don't really recommend eating a vegetable as part of your meal. Like, don't make them as a side. If there's a little bit of vegetables in your food, whatever, like say you're eating, uh, I don't know, a taco bowl and there's salsa in it, or there's a little bit of tomato in it. That's not the end of the world. That's fine. You're also not eating that stuff every single day, every single meal. That also makes a world of difference. Yogurt. Yogurt is good. Just make sure it doesn't have any fruit in it. Fruit's full of sugar, that's no good. So, plain yogurt's fine, Greek yogurt, it's all the same. If you wanna eat cream cheese, that's fine too. You can eat deli meats and stuff like that. That's not the end of the world. Some people tell you no, but uh, I personally don't think that they're a big deal whatsoever. Salt and pepper, definitely put all kinds on that, especially salt. In this diet, you need a lot of salt. So salt to taste, don't be afraid of the salt. Rubs, rubs are good, you can go crazy with the rubs. Just make sure there's not a shit ton of sugar in the rub. So, like on this diet, I eat ribs, I do pulled pork, I rub the shit out of that stuff. I don't put sauce on it, so it's more of a dry rub, you know? But I love it, I can eat that shit all day long. So, always check the ingredients and make sure there's not too much salt, uh, not salt, uh, sugar in it. Other than that, the diet's pretty simple. Eat all the seafood you want, that's not a problem. Whether it's fish, whether it's shrimp, lobster, you name it, you eat it. Diet doesn't get any easier than eating steak, eggs, and bacon. If you're bitching about eating steak, eggs, and bacon, then I think you're just happy being fat. So, stop complaining about the things that you can eat, like the fruits and vegetables. Oh my God, like eat a lot of that shit in the first place. There's a reason why you're in the in the place that you're at. Because you're eating too many of the things that you're not supposed to be eating. I'm not saying to never eat those things, but all those things are supposed to be treats. You're not supposed to be eating fruit every single day. You're not supposed to be eating cake every single day. You're not supposed to be eating any of that stuff. So, once in a while is fine. The way I like to do things is, I stick to the diet, I don't have any cheat days, but my cheat days, they're there, but they're not planned. My cheat days are when I have a special occasion. Birthday, Christmas, Easter, Thanksgiving, you name it. Those are my special occasions, those are my cheat days. I try to never have more than one a month. So, if you have multiple things, pick one, because you can't cheat on them all. That's gonna fuck you up. So, 
that's basically how I tackle things. There'll be more videos on that later. Right now, I just want to shoot a simple video on uh, what the carnival diet, diet is. And uh, I'll go into a little more detail later on. But uh, you can use this as a framework to get yourself started.